district, which includes Lower Waipaho to Ever Beach. He is the chair of the Public Safety, Military, and Intergovernmental Affairs Committee. He also serves as a majority floor leader. And Will has really supported me in all our endeavors, all our programs, all our presentations, and I really, besides, he has to, because he's one of my BFFs. Thank you, Senora. Good evening, aloha to everybody. On behalf of the Hawaii State Senate, I'm just very happy and honored to be here with all of you as we do celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month. You know, our islands, as we all know, is a melting pot. And no one is a minority. Uh, we all blend well together. Many people don't realize that the Hispanic community is well over 100,000 in our state. And whether they're in business, politics, labor, performing arts, they have contributed, like all other ethnicities and races, to our great state. And it's by all of us contributing and being part of this community that we do make this state the best place that it is for all generations. But tonight we're here to watch some outstanding performances from many individuals locally and from the mainland. And I'm very happy. Um, uh, La Senora is not only uh, a BFF, but uh, one of my constituents as well, as well, who has supported me throughout the years. And I uh, likewise have always supported her in all she does, especially the, the cultural aspect, because politics can sometimes get pretty crazy out there, but what brings us all together is our culture, our identity. And again, together we make up the beautiful harmony and peace that we have here in Hawaii. And on behalf of the Hawaii State Senate, I'd like to present this certificate to La Senora for all of her work she's done for the Hispanic community and for the state. 